we've had some trouble at the Olympics. There's been some athletes who are already tossed out of the Olympics for drug use. Yo, yeah, it's awful. You hate to see it. It's all covered in this announcement. Take a look right here. Two members of the Russian bobsled team have been disqualified after testing positive for steroids. One German speed skater has been disqualified after testing positive for the stimulant pseudoephedrine. And one member of the Swiss ski team has been disqualified for murder. You just seem a lot more stable. I see you as more serious than he is. He kissed on Kinder a few times. And he's like, he's like, we'll let alcohol do it to me sometimes. You know, it makes you a little more friendly. So this is something you would have to worry about with me. Me and Sarah are connected on a level that I feel is strong enough to carry me through to win this. I'm going to take every opportunity that I can, and I'm going to run with it. If you were watching that uh, U.S. Open on Sunday, you would have seen that sometimes even the best players in the world don't totally commit to a shot. Tiger Woods at number 10 hit a perfect tee shot, down there where he had just a sand wedge left to the green. Front right hole location, a great Aftermath, chance for him to get a shot. Documenting the traumatic right events of the Lapine family. Recently, I got to sit down with Monique Lapine, mother, author, and a devoted Christian, as she shared with me what it has been like happening. living in the shadows you of know, her son. Somewhere family. later on, when you start bringing your small subsect of friends or whatever, and they kind of give you the thumbs up, like, wow, this is good, or this place is special, or something like that, then that starts building, you know, a level of hype. Outside your close circle, you just didn't go blab in your mouth about, Mount Evans is the greatest bouldering area ever, you know, because then you get grief from your buddies when a bunch of randoms showed up the next day. The money goes over, that's not going to happen, is it? No. So, Pisha, here are the categories for your game. Each category has ten questions. And they are Vive la France, love songs, out of this world, biopics, state nicknames, Bible characters, time for a laugh, what a dream team, and the X Factor. Let's go with it. Out of this world. Sounds good. Okay. I think home health care has to Perfect. be a part of the solution to, uh, to health care costs. I am very, very proud of the fact that so many, overwhelmingly, of our citizens have health insurance uh, today and access uh, to great quality care. But the cost is just too much, and it's not a problem unique to Massachusetts. It's a problem all over the country. There are so many studies that show how much more effective, uh, from a cost perspective, uh, care delivered at home is than delivered in many uh, uh, more uh, institutional settings. When I say universal care, I really do mean universal care, not just uh, folks who understand the healthcare system and how to navigate it, not just the folks who live close to a terrific healthcare center or in some ways involved in a hospital. I mean the folks in, in neighborhoods that are hard to get to and where they don't feel necessarily connected to the, uh, to the economic mainstream. Their health is important to us as well. And, uh, and the VNA um, has to be one of the partners and has been one of the partners in reaching that part of our community. I think the VNA, if I may say, understands that notion of my chest. About the like I was person. Superman out there. Like I, I saved the day and that's why I got a medal on my chest. And you know, it's interesting because I don't hang any of those medals in my house. I don't even know where they are. Uh, I lose sleep at night, every day of my life thinking about those men who were wounded that time. If I'd have gone right instead of going left, if I'd have gone this direction, if I'd have come at this time, if I'd have used this air support, what could I have done? Because ultimately it's my responsibility. It was my decisions that put those men in the places where they got hurt. The way it plays over in my head is, you know, what if we would have made that turn and then a little kid would have hit Ebanks' truck, or y'all's truck. <laughs> yeah, think about that. You know, to, to be able to see him functioning in, 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 in a marriage and, and raising a child and doing those things helps. Uh, it really does help. But at the same time, you know, he's not able to do what, what he loves in life. He's still held, held back by his disability because of what took place that night. I can't go back that night and, and change anything. I, if I could, I would. I don't blame you at all, dude. At all. I appreciate that, man. I have no regret whatsoever. 
what is it what happens <laughs> <laughs> i mean it's gonna take a little bit a little bit more than that to take me out yeah